All right, folks, how you doing? Russell True Results 303.com. Check out the website. Subscribe to the channel. Links in the description box on how to connect with me through other social media platforms. And I'm coming at you today just with a video on sacrifice. Because right now, when you start to, you know, lose the motivation to get into the gym, you're not seeing results, you know, something strange is going on in life. We just have to realize that we have, there's some things that we have to sacrifice. And for myself, I had to do the same thing. I don't think it's different for anybody, even if it's you're starting up your own business, you know, work in general, you're going to have to sacrifice free time with family if you have to go in on weekends. You know, there's a lot of areas in our life where we have to sacrifice. And during our fitness journey, it is no different because over the years we program ourselves with negative habits and unfortunately that's what has gotten us into the position that we're in right now. So for myself, I used to be a big partier hanging out with friends seven days a week, even if it was the most non-productive time that I, you know, using my time as non-productive as possible. I've never been a big video game person, but I would seriously go over to my friend's house just to drink or just to hang out and watch my friends play video games for seven hours straight, whatever it might be. But we've got to realize that we have to sacrifice some of these things. And for myself, it was time with friends. Why? Because I was there every day. If you're there every day, Every hour of the day, you are unable to achieve what you want to achieve. But of course, it's something that I had programmed myself to do for long periods of time. And we have to realize that these are negative habits in our life that are preventing us from achieving whatever it is. It might not be a fitness goal, but it could be your goal of going back to school, your goal of trying to find, you know, a wife. If you're just sitting in a house, someone else's house, you're not going to be able to achieve these goals that you have set for yourself. So we've got to realize first that we're going to have to kind of come back to ourself and we're going to have to be comfortable with not being around other people. We have to sit down and realize what do we have to sacrifice? TV time. That's a big thing as well. That's, that's preventing us from achieving great things. And I think TV is kind of the downfall of America right now because it's just mindless stuff and you just sit in front of it and you do nothing. You know, you just watch. You just watch it. I mean, it has no value really in our lives. And we can lie to ourselves. I've done it myself with, oh yeah, you know, I'm watching the History Channel. I'm learning something. It's it's still a lie because if, you know, learning about American history, an animal, whatever it is, that's cool, but that's still not something that's pushing you towards your goal. So we have to realize that we have to sacrifice things and you have to come up with that game plan. What, what, what sacrifices have you made? And of course, if we're talking about fitness, what sacrifices have you made? Are you still going out to eat all the time? You, you have to sacrifice that for your fitness goals. It's not something that you have to sacrifice for your entire life. But in order to achieve our goal, we have to realize that we have to sacrifice that for a short period of time. We have to sacrifice TV for a short period of time. And usually that's going to be three, four, five, six months a year. We have to sacrifice doing those things and putting ourselves first. That's what it's about. It's about putting you first. We have to sacrifice these outside influences that are most likely having a negative effect on, on your life, my life, and do what is right. So the big question I'll just ask you right now is what are you sacrificing? Have you sacrificed going out to eat? Are you sacrificing time in front of the TV to make it to the gym? You know, I, I understand that that people want to go out. Like I have a client who who's really likes to play golf now, but in my and I and I, I always give him a hard time. In my opinion, that's not a workout. It's like, did you go work out? Well, I went and played golf. To me, that's not a workout. Okay, we need to make sure that we're getting to the gym. And then we can go and do those things. If you're going to go outside and shoot around with, with some friends playing basketball, to me, that's still not a workout. It's great to get outside, but we've got to make sure that we're pushing ourselves in the gym or at least in some strenuous activity to really get you 
moving forward and achieving those fitness goals. So the big, like I said, the big question is you have to seriously ask yourself, have you made the sacrifices that you need to make to get the results that not only you want, but you deserve? So sit down and, and really evaluate your goals again, because now it's February. A lot of people might be losing, you know, leaving the gym, losing that motivation because they're not achieving results. What have you seriously sacrificed in your life to achieve this? Because right now, we, we can all agree that you're doing this because you want to be happier. You want to be healthier. You want to be around for your children, for your grandchildren, whatever it might be. So have you made the sacrifices necessary? So that's the one thing I'm going to tell you right now. Sit down today. Sometime during this week, the next couple of days, and really write down your goals and what you need to do and how you've been slacking if you're not achieving those goals. Or areas of improvement where you, where, where you can improve to achieve your goals. So what sacrifices must be taken and what sacrifices have you not made? Because the only way you're going to grow stronger, you know, in your mentally physically and spiritually is you have to make these sacrifices in your life to become better. You know, stop worrying about the outside influences. Worry about yourself and what you got going for yourself. So, make some more sacrifices, you know, hunker down and do what you have to do to achieve your goals, to make yourself a better person. All right, so thank you for watching. Like I said, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Check out the website, trueresults303.com. Check the description box below to connect with me through other avenues of social media. And thank you for watching.